Welcome to the Legendary Studios. Today we are comparing Europa Universalis, The Price of Power, the Deluxe Edition, and the Standard Edition. Thanks for joining us. Okay, NATO. Right. So we, we each have a copy of the game. I haven't seen yours, you haven't seen mine. Correct. Yep. And uh, so we're going to pop these out and just do a little side-by-side -side comparison. Yes. <laughs> There we go. <laughs> yeah, that's a little bit of a height difference here, um, but uh, hey, that's uh, that's what you you know that's what deluxe is all about, right? Okay, let's and see who gets the best. Certainly a weight, a weight fart. difference. <laughs> yes. Oh yeah. Yeah. This one. Oh. <laughs> all right. Well, that wasn't very impressive. No, that wasn't. That's was fine. Oh, mine was there much better. Go. Okay. There we go. As far as box farts so, go. Maybe maybe the rules are less uh, long in your case. No, <laughs> okay. mine's a single page. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah, so we got... so this is our uh, reference chart. Exactly yeah, the same, same. Same there. Um, because you know why the deluxe? I because I, I, I don't want to give away the uh, you know the the answer here too soon. But part of the reason why the deluxe is the deluxe is because you can play more players. Yes. Exactly. <clears throat> right. So yeah. So these and. Uh, I'm not sure if the yeah you you would have the same solar They're exactly bond and the all same. that stuff right That's so there right. we go okay so now let's get into the fun components here we got all the charts okay. and all that stuff all that stuff gets on top but let's that. let's take a look at the the fun stuff here excellent so now I guess one of the main questions you have to ask if you're going to invest in one or the other is why why do you need to upgrade I mean mm -hmm. um, is it is it mostly the components that are are worth the upgrade or yeah. um, but in the end, like, do you ever regret buying a deluxe game over the standard edition game? No, especially if you, if I love the game. No, it's it's something that you feel you want to invest in. Yeah. In that, I very it, so. unless it's an absolutely terrible game yeah. that never makes it to the table. But you usually have a good sense ahead. If you're going to spend two hundred or three hundred dollars on a yeah. game, then you've done your research. You know what the game is. Yeah. And. To go back and say, oh, I wish, you know, I, if I, if only I hadn't spent that extra $40, yeah, you know? exactly, like, yeah. Sometimes it's, again, if, if it's a game that you love or you think you're going to love, now you put, you package your, your package uh, game a little bit differently. Like, yeah, what do you want to look at here? So let's look at the uh, player boards. These player boards here have a nice inset, uh, I don't know what to call that exactly, yes. but it's nice cutaway there's thing a bit of depth here, to it. bit of depth, so the pieces won't slide or rattle oh, around. Oh, that's gorgeous! Yes. Oh, I really like that. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Now, that's perfectly functional as well. It's not know? bad, but you know what? I mean, <laughs> I I would say it's not as functional though, because mm. for anyone who has cats, children, or yes. <laughs> clumsy friends, yes, cats, and a game that's likely going to last a, a very long, long time. time. Yeah. I mean, you jiggle the table, and all of your pieces are going to slide. Yeah, yeah. And so, so this, this, I mean, is definitely yeah. That's a big worth big an upgrade there. there. Oh, geez, that is yeah really nice. Yeah. Look at this. That's really cool. Okay, that's yeah. all right. Yeah. Now this little board here is the same as your as yours probably. Is that this one? Yeah. Uh, no, this, no. Is, this is the status mat. The status mat. Here okay. we go. Yeah. That's so, exactly the same. Yeah. So there you okay. go. No upgrade there. <clears throat> All right. And now... Now, do you have these um, little yes. army they're, fleet? They're buried, but yes, I've got those. And I think okay. they look the exact same. All right. We'll get so, those. So I'll set them aside so we don't yeah. forget. So let's save the board for later because I'm going to get... Yeah. Oh, yeah, here we are. Actually, good. I just revealed them. Yes. Oh, there they are. Okay. So, got, uh, so are they identical? They look pretty identical to yes, me. Yes, they are. Yeah. Okay. So no difference there. Okay. Now, this is, these are the pieces, and actually... Oh, no, these are... So <clears throat> this is a complete... The deluxe version is a complete set of wooden um, pieces. Everything here is a nice wooden token. You have a different color. Oh, this is because you have extra extra sets. sides. Yeah, that's so right. So color, here, let's compare let's yellow, color to yellow, yellow. Yellow to yellow. Yeah. All right. Yeah. This is a fair comparison. So mine only does four players. Yours goes up to six, six players. Yeah. That's so. right. 
Now, just to be clear, you can get the add-on to Europa Universalis. Uh, if you've bought the standard edition, um, that is an option to upgrade after mm -hmm. the fact. Oh, is it? Okay, so good to it know. It is, for sure. Good to know. Okay. So let's get these up here and so, see what we've got. All right, you have yours organized a little bit differently. Um, you, well, and that's the, fine. I had actually a problem organizing these because I wasn't exactly sure what went where. So I just had to sort of calculate mm -hmm. the number of tokens. And there are mixed. I mean, I've got... Yes. Uh, some of these yeah, in the here. Small, some of yes, these the in small here. towns and the yeah. That's so right. these are all um, these are wooden tokens here, as opposed to the cardboard. But that's now, a pretty thick cardboard, at, though. I mean, the the thickness is it's actually comparable. It's almost the same. Yeah. So unless you're so, in a habit of pouring water on your on your games, um, it's probably that's pretty. Not, that's not bad. Comparable. Yeah. Now I wonder. Can we see your these these boards? They're yes. Gonna, are they, they going to fit all right in there? Yeah, they do. So fit. it's a perfect fit there. Yeah. So I mean, if you had this, I I really like this. This yeah. is a really nice upgrade, I yes. think, and a functional upgrade. Um, this I'm yeah nonplussed a bit. Yeah. Well, it, at least it, it's you can certainly live with the, those tokens. Now the I think so. The um, <clears throat> the minis look to be the exact same. The yes, cubes they are. are the same. Let's get those out and just right. double and, check. Yeah. So these are identical. Identical. Yeah. So okay. that's fine. That's good. Uh, now, do you have these little cubes? Yes, the, I've got a bunch of those little cubes. Oh, okay. The influence cubes those or whatever. Those are the same. Yeah. And you have the the these markers as well in in wood. I can see them here. That's and the right. merchants are exactly also the same. You got the merchant is the yeah. same. Okay. The merchants I the same. I expected yours to be better. Yeah. Now the here's the difference though. The soldiers. Okay. So oh. Uh, and the boats. These don't look as good. Yeah. Uh, okay, so, and I think, where were my boats? I think they're in here. Yeah, so, there we are. <clears throat> so we've got the little wooden boats, and we've got the little wooden dudes right there. So that, I'm oh, sorry, they're not lying flat here, but that is... Uh, that's right. That's a uh, you know, much so, now significant do, difference. There. Do those go onto your board, or are they mostly just for they're gonna on, be the on the actual board? They're going to be on the board. Yeah, okay. Like the, These are for the these tokens and, that's and right. other tokens there. Right? Okay. The markers. So... That I would say is a pretty substantial, certainly from a aesthetic standpoint. It you is. know, it's uh, certainly an upgrade for that. What's this for? Um, that is extra space. I wasn't able to figure <laughs> okay. out what that little spot was for. Darn it! I could have used an extra slot. I know. <laughs> <laughs> so excellent. Yeah, so, so that's good. Overall, how would you rank these comparatively? Well, I would say well, it's kind of fifty-fifty because there are definitely the the boats and the and the armies there, definitely better with the deluxe otherwise comparable. pretty comparable yeah. you also have europa universalis yes yeah, so i got uh, the branding pressed right there. into it <laughs> right there. mine's nice and clear so yeah. if, if you don't mind it being obscured by the logo then uh, yes then this is the way to go yeah. but uh yes well yeah. that to me doesn't make a substantial difference okay. now <clears throat> what about these this part yes. here so this is the now, why on earth is mine so much larger than yours? Oh, because I've got... Uh, <laughs> you'll see in a sec. Okay. okay. So we've, the dice all look the same. What, what about the money, the ducats or ducats oh, or whatever yeah. they're called? See, yeah, they look about the same, actually. Now, this was the part I struggled with because I ended up with one big bin and yeah. then all these tokens. Oh, jeez. And I just tossed yeah, them all you're gonna in. Yeah, he's going to be sorting for a while. So whereas yours is much yeah. more organized. Yes. But have... I just don't have these columns for the ducats, right? Yes, okay, yeah. Um, but I do have my cards built in here. Oh, no, we've got that coming. Oh, it's you've coming. got another tray? There's another tray. Well, you tray. better get it out here. <clears throat> yeah. Okay, so that we'll assume these tokens are the same. Yes. Okay. But those don't, you don't have a holder for those. Uh, no, I did not. No, okay. Now, that, well, actually, can we... Oh, oh, so actually, we got standard edition has a holder so for the So here's cards. the deluxe tray. Oh. <laughs> Yeah. Okay, I retract the former statement. <laughs> okay, that's why there was no room for the cards oh, in that tray. Oh, that's really nice. Yeah, so it's all laid out. you got all your car the ages and all the idea cards, oh, power struggle boy. cards, everything there. And so, whereas I'm going to be double-deckered. Yes, so, so this is all laid out. And this, this tray presumably comes out, I haven't tried it, but it comes out as one go so you can have that to organize all the cards right there for you. So for people who are meticulous OCD board game organizers... <laughs> yes, this is where... This yes. is where it's at. Because honestly, this I'm not feeling good about this. And, yeah. and I'm not super OCD, you are. Yeah. I'm not, but this kind of bugs me yeah. because I'd just be searching through where's oh, the yeah. occupied you'd, you'd token. To, you'd have to yeah. have them piled as well. Well, and, and I just spotted actually. So for example, just sort of before you put that yes. away, um, so you have the the orange. 
Oh, right. Yes. Soldiers here, right? Yeah. And we have the the black pieces here. Uh, I don't even know where. Yeah. Yeah. Somewhere even, in I've here. Got a, I've got a boat. Oh yeah, there you go. The pirate. <laughs> you probably pirate have a ship. boat in yes, here somewhere. Yeah, over here. They oh, have their own separate. They've got their storage. own box. Okay. Yes. <laughs> so, yeah. Okay. Yeah. So that that's a that's a nice uh, a nice upgrade there that for is. sure. If you like the three dimensions. Yeah. Deluxe. Yes. Okay, awesome. cards are all the same though. Otherwise... The cards are the same, yes, yeah. I would say. Yeah. Very nice. So. Okay, so now onto the most important part. The boards. Oh, alright. So, so you these have a... would I would expect to be pretty much the same. They will be I identical, think I think. Yeah. Okay, yours on I don't know first. how well this is fitting in the camera zone here, but <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so that's that's this one double okay, sided. Let's just let's, let's toss mine on top. You've got the sure four. It's... Yeah. So this is the same side. Yeah, and, and that's yes. the exact same board. Exact same board. Okay. Okay. Now you have the smaller board with the colonies. I do. This is for the other, uh, the far away colonies. Is it? Mm hmm. All right. Okay. I imagine yours is identical. The identical there. Okay. Okay. And that's it for me. And in order to have six players, you got to have a little more table uh, space here. So this actually adds in Eastern Europe. Well, it depends on which era you're playing. This is the 1618 setup, and this is the whoops, the 1444 setup here. Okay. So if you are a person again who likes finished edges. <laughs> Yes. Uh, you will notice on these, this original board, yep. this kind of bugged me when I got it, because <laughs> this side just ends and there's no yes. border. Oh, yes, Because yes, the yes. two need to link up. Yes. And so I felt like, I, actually, the very first time I opened the board, I, yes. I was like, oh, no, I'm, I'm, I'm missing, missing part something. of it. Yeah, Some, nope. yeah something's not there. Well, you, and so this will... You are. So this, oh, so uh, this should around. actually slide right in here. It'll go right on and to right the edge. Against, yes, so there you go. So now it feels complete. Yes. So you complete it out there. <laughs> you yes. either need the expansion or you need the deluxe. <laughs> yeah, it's one of the two. <laughs> this, this is my yeah. board. Okay. Now, again, that said, like the components for the, the standard edition, I think they're great. There's nothing they're serviceable, wrong. I yeah, would say. They're very serviceable. Yes, actually. they are. Cax yeah. would say they're serviceable. Yes, they are. <laughs> yeah. Yes, I think you would. For sure. Um, so, um, yeah. But, but overall... I mean, what's the price difference here? Do you think are we? I'm not. Sh I'm not exactly sure. Actually, uh, I did find. I was looking around on uh, Board Game Geek, and I did see one listed for three hundred and twenty-nine dollars. Right. Okay. But I don't know whether and that's I think this a, one was more in the one hundred and fifty range. This is all like Canadian that. dollars. Yeah. Um, don't quote us on those prices. Yes. We, yeah. We're, we're not entirely sure. We're, we're, yeah. It's very. So. Uh, and <laughs> we forgot to research that bit before. So but it is anyway. a significant upgrade, uh, assuming those prices are anywhere close. Mm -hmm. You're paying a lot more money for this. But to be honest, with a game like this, if you're investing the time it takes to read a 40-page rule book with tiny, tiny 48 text, 48-page rule 48 book, page, yeah. then you're someone who's committed to the game and you're someone who cares about the, the game and the detail, and you're likely going to want the extension. However, that being said, how often will you get six players who understand yes. and know this That's game the, together? Yes, exactly. I mean, four is going to be a challenge, so maybe you don't need that. Yeah, yeah, and I, I you know, yeah, because if you have four players and if you're not you know, if you don't need the best, you know, of the best components, yep. you know, this nothing is perfectly fine. Yeah, absolutely yep. fine. Um, and uh, I mean, the deluxe edition is supposed to be deluxe, right? That's, that's right. how they, uh, that's, As advertised. that's why it's, yeah, it's exactly, it's why you, it's an upgrade. But, uh, but I think that, you know, this is, uh, it's a big game and yeah, it depends on, on uh, how much mileage you're expecting to get out of this game. Um, and basically, and this is... to be honest, after seeing his edition of the game and comparing it to mine, I don't feel that disappointed. I think that the biggest element that I would I would want are these boards. Yeah, these are just these are gorgeous. This is the best element for me. I mean, I can do with the wooden wooden meeples are fine. Mm -hmm. um, I'm fine with the tokens too. Yeah. So yeah. Um, overall. This this would be the, and the card the, what tray is kind of nice as well, it but is. it's not really. I mean, it's more of a storage thing than anything, and it's not necessarily True. anything to do with the gameplay. Once the cards are out and and so forth, you may you know may not be best to play out of these trays. I haven't actually experimented with that. It may just be that's right best to have the cards on the table where they're normally found, right? And so. comparing prices, we also have to remember that it, you would be comparing the price of this plus the expansion mm -hmm. compared to that because there's more game here than there is here. Yeah. 
So oh, okay. Overall, uh, if you have any thoughts on the differences between the editions, if you've played it, let us know how it's going. Yeah. And uh, don't forget to get out there. <laughs> get gaming. And be legendary. <laughs>